Hey, how's it going everybody? It's me, Scud Dog. Thanks very much for joining us. As you can see, we're about to play a new game. This game is called Drill Deal Oil Tycoon. Uh, I've played a little tiny bit of it. We've done the tutorial. I'm now about to start this North Sea mission. Destroy mines and upgrade the platform. Essentially, you run an oil platform in the North Sea, obviously. Uh, and uh, we, uh, we need to invest in a, a new platform, hire 15 employees and destroy all of the mines so uh, i'm gonna do my best to talk you through it i might i might struggle a little bit with explaining what the hell's going on but we'll do our best you can see there's some mines down here there's a there's a shark over here i think that's a whale i think that might be a whale. it could be a dolphin i don't know um and there's some mines over here there's there's whatever this is coral i don't know um anyway here is our here is our little oil platform we've got already built an expedition platform. We'll come back to that a bit later. We've got this little crane, which is where our, our ships drop things off, I think. Uh, and over over here, possibly. I'm not 100% sure what it all does. And then in the middle, the most important thing, we've got a giant drill. And that giant drill will uh, will drill for oil and gas. And as you can see, as the drill drills, we get crude oil over here, and we also get gas. Uh, and we're going to try and use that, sell it, make uh, make other products as we go. Uh, and see how we see how we end up. Additionally, we've got some other things that we can do. We can hire employees. We can view our employees. We can order in other things. So we could buy in building blocks which are required to build things, uh, meals and ingredients, and so on and so forth. So we can do all that stuff uh, over here. We can see how much water and meals we've got, how much medicine we've got, and in turn how much gas. And as we start drilling out other materials, we'll uh, we'll get some more. So we'll uh, we'll give this a go. It, it's probably going to go badly. But we'll work our way through it. The first thing we need is a basic refinery, which we're going to put uh, over here in the corner, I think. Uh, and that is going to work alongside this small gas generator, which I might put over here in this corner. So this is going to give us electric by using gas. And this is going to give us... Uh, I thought that fish was going to fish. That shark, dolphin, dolphin was going to swim into the mine, which wouldn't have been ideal. So this is giving us some power. You can see we're now up to 110 power, but we're also using 110 power. Uh, we've got no one working on any of these things. So we're not we're not drilling out any crude oil. We're not refining it into anything. And, uh, and that's going to cause us a problem. So we're going to go and hire some employees, which we can do from this menu here. You can see the options for the employees, what they're good at, and uh, and what they're not so good at it's difficult to tell exactly what these things are without clicking on them but what we can see is these guys are here and ready to drill they've got stars beside them i'm going to go for the cheapest one because i'm a cheapskate then we want someone who's good at refining um and i think you're good at drilling and refining we will hire you uh let's let's leave it at that for now let's unpause it we should see our little workers come wandering in uh, we're going to get you to work on the drill we may move you over to the night shift so you can see you can have a night shift and a day shift. And what you can see here is we are uh, producing 70 crude oil and 30 gas over here. We can change the production to say 50 of each. Um, but for the time being, let's go with the crude oil. Uh, this is telling us how much we're using. Over here, we're going to click on this and we're going to say uh, we need a worker over here. Let's get you in. You're not working on this. Let's get you over here. And these guys are going to start working on this stuff for us. I'm not sure what this icon means. Look at these mines. They're going to hit my boat. I'm not sure what this icon means. So I guess we'll find out. Does it mean it's not connected? I don't know. So you can see here we're getting uh, we're getting 20. Sorry, we've got 20 crude oil. We're going to get 118 over the course of a day. Uh, we're also getting gasoline. And we're also getting heavy oil. So all of these things are happening uh, as we go because our drill is drilling and getting these things out and this is converting into these three things so uh all in all oh i can i can change this but it doesn't change to anything all in all we're getting some resources that's the important takeaway point from here i'm just going to pause the game a little bit because there's some more things we need to talk about uh, over here we've got some research now you can see we've got some money in the top left hand corner we're losing money per day that's because we're not selling anything but there's research trees here but you you unlock them by spending money so we could buy better capacitors which means we get more power uh, as we, you know from our electricity we can buy basic oil production which will mean we can convert 
some of our, our crude oil into lubricant, I think it is, and so on and so forth. And you can work your way along along these things. Um, and we can we can increase our storage and, and all sorts of other stuff. Uh, what does this do? Unlocks uh, drill two, main drilling building. Employees working here extract gas and crude oil from beneath the ocean. It's just an upgrade for the, for the building. So I think certainly getting basic platform, that gives us a... 20% drill efficiency and getting capacitors because that's going to increase our power and at the moment now we've got a little bit of leeway with power so we've got workers but those workers are not going to be happy uh, we're also getting uh, items in and we're, we're not able to do anything with it I'm going to leave this going for a bit because we want to we want to get some of this stuff in stock uh, but we could have a little look at what else we could build so we've got options we've got industry buildings social buildings and other buildings look at industry buildings first you can see we can build more bits of the platform if we wanted to we need 100 100 building blocks for that we don't have them we could come back over here and we could build uh, a small chemical plant but we need to unlock it via research and everything else industry wise is unlocked is locked um we can um we can use these connectors to connect up buildings which will give us a bonus if they're next to each other uh, but for now, we'll ignore that. We're going to come down here and click on this. This is social building. So we're going to need uh, some quarters and a buffet for our, our people. We'll probably need a kitchen to feed people. Uh, and then we'll also need to unlock a cinema to keep people happy. We need to, to satisfy their needs. Uh, and if we click on our employees, we'll be able to see their need for rest, their need for food, and their need for entertainment. Uh, and then finally, down here, we've got other buildings and mostly this is storage so you can see we've got a lot of storage here we may want to get some storage as we go you'll notice that we've also got water and we don't get any water in but we can unlock water purifiers <coughs> apologies we can unlock water purifiers but i think for the time being we'll pass on that i do think we need to build a basic employees quarter so i'm going to put that i'm going to put that over here i think i don't know if, if that gives us enough room to get round Let's put it here. I don't think it gives us enough room to get around, but we'll put it there. Congratulations, your oil platform has achieved level two. So that means we can command a higher price when we're when we're selling our oil. This is going to get built. At least we're going to be able to take care of one of our needs. I'm going to ignore this expedition. It comes in quite handy, but I'm going to ignore it for now. And we'll keep crude oil drilling and uh, and heavy oil drilling. What I might do, and I don't know if this is a clever idea or not, we're going to come and grab you. Because you can work on the drill. You're actually no, you know what? I'm not gonna do that. I'm going to I'm gonna hire someone else, someone cheap. You, because you can do some refining. And I'm gonna hire you just because you're cheap. And that's it. And then we're gonna say, okay, in the night shift, we want this dude. And over here in the night shift. We want this dude. And now we're going to increase our, our drilling capacity. You will see that the 24 hours increases on how much we're able to get in. Um, and therefore, we'll be able to sell more, I think, is the goal here. And if we come over to here, we can see what we can do to set up sale deals. So I can sell gasoline and fuel to these two companies. Um, and I can I can do quick deals up here of, of these things. So what we need to do is we need to start converting our uh, crude oil which we're getting into these other other resources that we can start selling so if we come back to our research and have a look down here we've got to unlock small chemical plant and lubricants container uh, enable lubricants production and i think that's what we need to do so i'm going to click on this and buy this one then we're going to come into this and build our industry building which is a small chemical plant it requires 50 power so we're going to need more power uh, which is going to be tight with the money. Uh, we're going to need 50 building blocks, which I think we have, but only just. And we're going to need a worker. And if we look on this, the input is is fuel and the output is lubricant. So I think we're going to build you and we'll build you over here next to this. And then we're also going to come over here and grab one of you and just put you next door to this one. Great. We're now level three. Uh, and we should have have items coming in. So let's just have a little look here. We've got crude oil and gas coming out of here. 
Uh, in here, we've got crude oil going in and that being turned into um, gasoline, fuel oil and heavy oil. And that's both happening at night. So next up, we've got our... I'm just wondering if we were to go back here and change this, we'd get more gas out and we get less crude oil out. I don't know what one is, is better for us at this moment in time. The other one, because you can see over here, this just changed to minus 88, um, which is not good. But hopefully we'll see the change. We're now on the night shift. Um, our efficiency is really good at night. Interesting that we're not making any more of this, but we are getting all of these things. So we can start thinking about selling because obviously we don't want to get full and then not be able to do anything with this. So I'm going to come over here uh, to the deals page and I'm going to say, right, you want gasoline. Uh, we have a 120 in storage, but we are making, I think we are making 291 a day. So I am going to come over here and say, you can have of this, let's say 250 units a day. I don't know if that don't know if that works. That's a lot of money incoming a day. I'm just going to bring it down to 200 just in case because I don't know. This would indicate to me every 24 hours we make this, but I'm not convinced. So I'm going to click renew because I want to keep doing this and I'm going to say deal over here. I'm then going to look at this one, the Norway oil who want uh, fuel oil. We make 291 of that a day as well. So let's say we can do 200 of that and we're going to say deal. Um, and that's it. We've got some some things down here. Oops. Uh, we've got some things down here that we can unlock. So we could unlock uh, solid fuel, which we don't make at the moment. Or we can unlock heavy oil which, we, oil, which we do make at the moment. Just not a huge amount. But if we were to unlock this, we could potentially sell that as well. So I'm going to do that. We're going to come back to deals. And I'm going to say, at the moment, we make 72. We've only got 30 in stock. Let's say we, we did 50 of these uh, and we want to renew this one as well. And therefore, we've got another deal. Let's see. And I don't know how this is going to work. Let's see if that works out. We've got very little money, but I'm kind of hoping that as time goes on, our money is going to increase. You're wandering around. Um, I don't know why you're wandering around, but you are wandering around. Um, We've got no one working in these now. Did I? Oh, I didn't buy anyone to work in these. That will, that will probably help. Now this is interesting because this is going to affect our fuel if we were to to buy get someone in here. So I'm going to hold off for now because I just want to see how this plays out. Because obviously we want to make lubricant, um, and then we want to think about some other things. Gravity drainage, high tech. We, uh, we probably need to think about getting um, basic maintenance, which will give us a workshop so we can fix anything that gets broken. We also want to get a basic cinema so we can keep people happy because they will get moody. As you can see up here, amount of missing basic buildings. Uh, it's good to have a canteen, a workshop, and any buildings from the entertainment group. We will try and get those, but we need to get some money in. Uh, so we'll hold off for now and we'll just see what, we'll just see what happens. We've got four employees of seven. Uh, we've got no one working in these, but I think that's fine. We could potentially get a couple of employees to work in this. Uh, and what they'll do is when we click on this, you can go on an expedition uh, and you can uh, you can go away, find some resources, find some, some money, those sorts of things. Repair your building. Technical condition of a building deteriorates. We kind of know that. I think we're okay. I don't think it tells you that. So this, this guy has come in. He's looking for 200 heavy uh, 50 heavy oil which we have got he's looking for two 200 fuel and 200 gasoline that's exactly what we've got i'm a little bit worried about our numbers now we're down to 24 hours uh, making these things we've got i mean we've got this guy working hard right we've got these guys working hard overnight so i guess we'll just have to keep an eye on those numbers and see if they go up or down that's a a bit of a concern um We've still got crude oil going up. These numbers are not increasing, which worries me slightly. I don't think there's anything else we're doing differently, right? We're just working on, on these. I guess we could get another one of these in. You know, we've got 280 crude oil, so we could get another one of these in and just have people working this constantly to fill up our quota of these things. 
that might be the way forward i don't know i don't know we've got 2378 but that is going to be a problem because we're not going to continue hitting these objectives i don't think our contractor demand is 200 a day uh, or maybe that's taken that into account right there it has perfect so we're we've got 291 production and we're selling 200 therefore we're left with 91 that's fine so we don't have to worry too much about it we've got a bit of money so what do we need to do we know we need a, a buffet car or a kitchen for our people so i think let's build a small kitchen um and let's put you over here i think Let's also build a buffet. And I think, is there anything else we want to do? We would like these cold food storages so we can store more food, but I don't think that's it's a huge problem at the moment. So let's build those two. We're going to need to bring someone in. Small kitchen has been created, so we need to hire someone to come and be our chef. You can do cooking. You're quite expensive. We're looking for cheap people here. You're a cook and you're cheap. You are perfect for us. Might be a rubbish cook. We don't care. So the day shift, you are going to do some cooking for us. Uh, now that takes water and it takes food. And we haven't got a huge amount of food ingredients. So we can buy some stuff in. So we're going to go over to our ship. We're going to say we want to buy some building blocks. I'm going to say about 500, uh, 51, sorry, about 500 pounds worth. And we want some food and we're going to say maybe something like this just to it's going to cost us 800 odd just to get the ship here with some stuff in is there anything else we want we've got medicine uh, we can't buy water so we need to unlock a water purifier uh, at some point but for now we're okay let's just jump back to this menu uh, and let's see where the defensive turret we know we need that um, where will i find a water filter up here simple filter we want to buy you it's 800 i'm going to spend all our money on it and then we're just going to hold off so we can make a water filter we're over our power budget which is a real pain in the backside maybe we can do something about that so i'm going to come over here to our contracts and we have ways of selling uh stuff out of the you know out of the the quotas that we've got cheaply so over here i could sell some gas and that's what i'm going to do just for 600 bucks there we go and then I wonder if we can come and build another one of these. Uh, it costs 300. Let's just put another one of you down. Just down here. We're up to level four. That's fine. Uh, and then you should have enough power. We should be making enough meals. And everyone should be happy. Obviously, we've only got enough uh, storage for, for 25. So, so I think that's fine. Let's just come back over here into employee care. And we want a basic cinema. So we need to get this one first. And then we want to get you, which is 600. So we're going to have to wait for our ship to arrive. Has it arrived yet? Here it is. This is delivering some stuff for us. So that's fine. We're going to get some food ingredients and uh, whatever else, some building blocks I think we, we requested. And we've got no one making meals in the kitchen at night, which I think is fine. There we go. We've got some food. We've got some building blocks. You're going to disappear. We've got 110 bucks. 30 sorry three out of three contracts have been fulfilled which is nice don't know where our money is mind you um maybe we have to wait for it to, to leave the map before we get some cash i don't know um but you know things are going all right right things are going well we've got some people wandering around no one's sleeping at night which is a bit of a odd one i guess they're not going to the cinema because we just don't have one uh, but it'd be really nice to see some cash come in um so we can then here it comes. Here comes the here comes the ship. Have we got what it needs? I think so. It looks like we're pretty good. We're full of crude oil. There we go. We've got new employees. Entertainment buildings. Keep your employees happy. It's exactly what we needed. We needed your money. We're going to come over here. We're going to unlock the basic cinema. Then we're going to come over here. And in buildings... I'm going to build a small cinema and I think we'll just put it over here. Uh, and then we need to hire an employee who can who can entertain this fella down here. 67 bucks. Um, there you go. We've got you. I don't know when to make you work. Most people are working days. So I'm going to put you in the night shift, I guess. 
That seems to make sense to me. So these guys are still going. We're still working on these contracts. That's fine. Uh, crude oil, we're full. We've got no one working. I think that's what that's telling us. Um, you would turn that into... We don't necessarily need it. I do wonder if we just get another one of these. Since we're full of crude oil. I mean, it's expensive. But I do wonder if that's the way to go. If we had a second refinery. We can't. We need more building blocks. We've only got... We've only got 81. And I think the only way of getting building blocks is to order them in. Um, so let's do that. Let's get another... Another 38 should do us. That'll actually let's bring this down a little bit. We need 80. How much does how much does this thing cost to build? Uh, 500. So we've got a little bit of leeway there. So let's let's say like 25. Thing is, it costs us to bring in the ship. It costs 100 bucks to bring in the ship. So holding off until we've got some more money is probably wise. Um, crude oil, is that coming down? It is, but not, not enough. Now we could put some storage in, so we store more crude oil. Um, what is this telling us? Is this, this is making noise, I guess? Is that what it's saying? Noise penalty. People entering this building suffer satisfaction penalty. Fair enough. I mean, I, I guess they're going to be okay. They're watching a film, right? You'd hope they'd be all right. Uh, I'm guessing that means we don't have a workshop. So we should look at building a workshop. We can now unlock some of these things so we could get some more storage if we wanted to. I, I, I can only assume that you have to buy these. I don't know any other way of making them, which is a bit of a shame. It'd be nice to make some. Let's just have a look at our employees. They seem like they're okay. Dangerous Mines, minus 10. Eats poor food, minus 5. You know, they seem like they're okay, right? Here comes the ship again. I'm guessing we can reach our quotas. We can. That's good news. We're almost full of employees. We're almost out of power. And we got 2,000 bucks in. So what was it I was going to build? I was going to buy some more simple blocks. And then we were going to... Uh, and then we were going to um, and then we're going to build another refinery, right? Not sure if that's the right way forward, but let's do it. Let's, you know, we only find out this way, right? What do we want? We wanted to buy some blocks in. So let's buy, uh, let's say we want 50, maybe. No, let's say we want 100. That'll, that'll do us, right? We're up to set. We've got 71. Let's say we want 100. Do we want anything else? We've got enough food ingredients. Water hasn't come down that much. I think we're good. So let's do that. Ship is coming in. Uh, we need to... Oh, we need to build a... A... Um, a workshop. I can see that some of these things are broken. So uh, what have we got? We've got this. Buy for 200. Perfect. And then let's build a workshop somewhere. I think it's down here maybe. Nope. I think this is the hardest thing, finding the things you want on these menus. There it is, a workshop. Can't really fit it in anywhere, which is, well, we can. We can fit it over here, but I don't really want to, is what I'm saying. Let's put you over here. Let's unpause. We're going to have a problem trying to get more people because we don't have a big enough, uh, we don't have a big enough workforce. And I don't think you can say, let's get one person to work the day and night shift. Uh, let's have a little look at employees. So we want people who can refine. So let's hire you. And let's hire you. We can't. Okay, let's first of all get someone on, on here. I'm just going to put you on here for now. You'll fix things. You'll just be slower at it. But we do need to fix some stuff. So let's get that happening first. Please. Here we go. Going to come and fix this. Oh, the weather's turned somewhat. There we go. Now we're fixing these things. So I don't think they're quite broken because we've still got enough power. So I'm assuming we're okay from that point of view. Uh, we got 71 blocks again. <laughs> 
Orders aren't available during storms. It's not ideal. Uh, entertain. Why are they unhappy? I guess because they work during the day and therefore they don't have anything to do at night. Is the is the issue here? Oh, I see. You're not working. You're not working nights, right? Can I get you working nights now? Does that work? I suspect you're going to be a little bit annoyed, but. I don't suppose it matters if you work day or night. It's the only issue is we can't get you to, to do these things. Okay, good. So I think the storm will pass. Let's hope the storm passes. It's quite the hefty storm. And we haven't seen the ship come in, obviously, because of the storm. Here it comes. Uh, I think we've got what we need again. I think we're all right. Yeah, we look pretty good. Uh, and now we've got a second refinery. We don't necessarily... Or we ha When we get a second refinery, we're not necessarily going to have the people to work it. So it doesn't feel like it's quite the right choice here. But... Did we get blocks? And did I use them all? Now here, here they come, right? This has got our blocks on. Perfect. So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to say night shift, day shift. We're going to make you work days for now. Just so the people who are on days can uh, can come and, uh, come and do their thing. So we should see you unload and we should see... Should see some... Uh, some blocks and stuff coming in. Perfect. See you later. Thank you. Uh, what did we need to do? I can't quite remember. One person is very unhappy. What? Who is it and why? Is it because I made them work the late and night shift? Yeah, I think it's you. Sorry about that, dude. You'll be all right. Stop worrying. Um, and this is the problem. We've got seven employees. So could we? And this is probably the wrong suggestion. I think I wonder first, do we do we get the defensive turret? Or do we try and, from here, build an extension to our oil platform? And can we do that, is the question. Build platforms at some distance from other uh, other platforms. Yeah, but how do we... Oh, I guess we connect it up with a bridge. I see. Okay, so if we were to have one of these, for example... This seems like it might be really expensive. This costs 100 building blocks. Wowza. Okay. We'll keep an eye on that because I'm not quite sure we're, we're ready for that. Although we could just build it. Right, we could just build it. Not sure that's the way forward, but it is the right thing to do for us to move forward. Let's... Let's come over here, let's do security, and let's buy a defensive turret, and let's build one. I think that's the way, I think doing that is the way to get more employees, unless you can do it from these windows. I don't think you can, I think it's, I think it's something else. Basic education? Yeah, I, I don't think it's here that you do it. I think it's having a bigger platform gets you more employees. Uh, so can we build a gun? That's the next question. Defensive turret requires more resources. What does it need? Lubricant. We need some lubricant. Okay. So let's let's put someone on the day shift over here. We can't hire anyone new, so I'm just going to put someone on uh, for a day or so. Let's take someone out of... We can't take him out of the cinema again. Let's take you out of here for now and put you in there. We'll have you work on this just for now because that is going to make us some lube and we definitely need lube even if all we do it for is for the time being to to make our uh, to make our gun how much do we need 50 I think it said where did I see that it is 50 a hundred lube. Okay, we've got eight. This could take a while. This could take a while. 
So we now got people working night shifts. You're going to go and fix these things, hopefully. Got no one in the cinema. We'll switch over our cinema worker a bit later. Oh, no. Yeah, you're working during the day. So we've got no one working. Uh, these people are going to be a bit grumpy because they've got nothing better to do. You're still pretty upset. You're working in the cinema, but you're in the day shift. So you're not working tonight. I guess that means you've got nothing to do. Yeah, so the, problem, the biggest problem for us is workers, really. Be nice to get that fixed. Still only got eight lube, obviously, because we're not going to be doing anything tonight. Let's speed this up so we get through the night a little bit quicker. The ship is arriving, taking more stuff away from us, which is fine. I guess we could get in another contract. We could sell some of this stuff straight off, you know, just to free up some some money, but that's fine. We just want to work on the lube. We're going to get 36 a day, so we've still got quite a while to wait. Let's, um, let's move you to the night shift. And we're just letting kind of the, the days pass, really. We've got a grumpy, grumpy person, but I think they're always going to be a bit grumpy. Um, We've got these still going. We could increase our our deals, but they're auto renewing, so maybe not. The question is, could we take another deal? Could we take another deal that opens up our sale of, of something similar? You want lubricants. We don't want to sell that for now. More heavy oil. So we're making 22 a day, so we could take that and sell it. Or sulfur. Well, we're not getting any of those. And this is solid fuel. I don't know how to make that. Okay. So we're up to four grand in the bank, which is nice. Or five grand in the bank, really. Um, what do we want? Do we need any? We need some people back in the kitchen. So how much lube have we got? We haven't got enough. So I'm going to take you out of here when it gets to... We could just buy meals in, really, but... When it gets to night time, I'm going to take you out of here and put you in here. So let's go here your bob halbert i'm gonna put you in here bob halbert no actually let's do it at night shall we just to annoy you so you're gonna come over here and do some cooking for us as well so that's fine uh, we're up to 64 lubricants we could buy some meals in just to, to bypass this stuff but i think this is fine we'll just keep going for the for the time being. Another contract done. Love that. So we're, we're making money. Oh no, there's a storm. That's not ideal. I'd really like to shoot these bombs or mines. And I feel like we'll have made some progress. Um, I guess we could, we could think about doing this, right? And it takes a hundred blocks. But we could think about doing this. Fine, we'll do it. Build an additional platform. Nice. We did it. We did it. These guys are wandering over here. Don't know why. Nothing to do over here, boys. Head back. Uh, we can't order things in for a, during a storm, but I'd like to. Um, I'd like to buy some meals. And I'd also like to buy some more blocks. Does this mean our employee quite has gone up? To increase the, your limit, build more quarters. I see. Okay, we can do that. That's that's easier than I thought, right? We just need to build another one of these. Let's put it over here. We can't. There we go. There we go. We've got a new building quarters. We can hire more employees. That's really useful to us. So let's go and do that. Uh, we want to hire another refinery person. We want to hire... Who else do we want to hire? I, I guess it doesn't matter too much. Let's hire the cheapies. You and... Let's hire you. Okay, perfect. So we've got some employees in. I want a worker over here at night making lube. Please. Let me choose you. 
because we need the lube for our for our guns um sorry yeah to make guns we've got two people working in here we've got two people working in here we don't have anyone working in here during the day um and then we just got one person working on the lube i think that's fine we could hire another person if we got one person who's not doing a job we've got two people who are not doing a job so let's put one of you in here for now and is there another job that we'd like people to work on you could make meals for us but someone could work in the cinema and i think that might cheer some people up so let's get you doing that for now here comes the ship again perfect we're going to order in some more of these we want to buy how much can we have we can have 200 how much does that cost this 2000 yeah i think that's fine so let's Oh, we can't have 200 because that would put us over the quota. Uh, let's do 189 then. Um, I think that's fine. Do we need anything else? Food ingredients? I guess we should get some. Just something like that. Should we get like good meals? Let's just get a few good meals. It's going to cost us a reasonable amount, but let's do that. We haven't used any medicine. That's fine. Okay, ship should be coming with that stuff. Uh deals do we want to do we want to have a think about any more deals I, I wonder if we could renege these but i think we're okay you know it's doing the job for us for now so we've got we've got enough almost got enough for this to make a gun which is very exciting stuff Got 200 building blocks, which is lovely. And we now have enough lube. <laughs> okay, let's let's lube this up with a gun over here. Here we go. We'll put it here. It's perfect. Now we can turn this on and we can shoot these. What do you mean I can't shoot now? Oh, is it because there's a ship here? Let's just slow this down a second. Cannot shoot now. Why not? I want to shoot. What's going on over here? I don't know why I can't shoot, but let's... Oh, because we're out of power, I presume is probably the reason can i build another one of these just a small one in here i can probably fit it in that gap right still got 150 blocks that should put us into the into the place power wise we should be all good turn this on boom I think we're looking pretty good over here. Oh, that's a tad annoying. We can't shoot the other one. What do you think you're doing? Nice, we did it. I have 15 employees we didn't complete, but we completed this one with two stars. We could have just built another thing and, and done that one. Let's go. Uh, let's go back to the main menu. And now we should see we've completed this one with two stars. We can move on to the next. I'm not going to do that. I wanted just to let you have a little look at this. Uh, obviously, when you get here, you can so it look like you had to work your way around to this. I think you can just start. No, it doesn't look like you can. So you're going to have to work around to here, natural disasters, to then uh, do the uh, to then be able to do the sandbox. But I think the sandbox would be fun. Um, but there you go. This is uh, this is deep drill. No drill deal. Oil tycoon. It's available today. I don't know the price. Uh, it's a fun little game. I think the price will depend on my recommendation. Um, if you like the look of it, the link is in the description below. Please go and, uh, and check it out on Steam. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to the devs who gave me a key. Uh, please hit the like button, subscribe button, follow us on Twitter, Scott Gaming. We'll see you again soon. Thank you.